So guys, in our last session, what we have understood, we have understood comparison operator. Now, what exactly we are going to discuss in this session? So in this session, we are going to discuss the arithmetic operation. What all the arithmetic operation are available? Or I can say that arithmetic operators are available. So let me begin. So guys, uh, there are uh, as usual four arithmetic operator available in the Oracle database. As you can see on the your screen, these are the arithmetic operation available in the Oracle database. Now, I don't think uh, you need uh, any explanation on this arithmetic operators. Now, let's have a direct practical on this. So guys, just right now we have seen the theory part of the arithmetic operator. Now, it's time for the practice. So before we start our practice, I would like to show you the content on which I am going to use the arithmetic operator or I can say that I am going to perform the arithmetic operation. So let me show you. So as you can see over here, this is the query which I have written in order to get record from the employee table on which I am going to perform the arithmetic operation. So let me show you the content. So guys, this is the content on which I am going to perform the arithmetic operation or I am going to use the arithmetic operator. Now, over here, I have selected few columns from the employee table, okay, which is salary, department ID, first name, employee ID, okay, and which record I have extracted where employee ID is equal to 100. Now, I am going to use the arithmetic operator or arithmetic operation on this data. So how can I perform the arithmetic operation? I can perform simply like this. Let's say for example, I want to divide by 10. Then how can I do it? I can do it like this. And what is the result? As you can see on screen, this is the uh, after division, this is the value. Let me show you the actual value as well so that you will understand more better. So let me fire once again. So as you can see over here, this is the actual value and this is after the arithmetic operation. Instead of this, you can use simply plus as well. So as you can see over here, the arithmetic operation has performed and this is the value we got. Now instead of plus, you can use minus uh, into whatever you want to use, you can use it. Let me show you this also. So you can see here, you have multiplied with it 10. Now, instead of this, I can use uh, another kind of operation as well. Let's say for example, I want to use uh, to add um, two columns, which is having the number data type. Okay, so I can do it like this. So as you can see over here, department ID plus salary is equal to this one. So you can see where, to, uh, 24,090. So this is the value. So this is how also you can now you can use uh, for the division also. So after division, what is the value? So you can see over here, this is the after division. So uh, like this, you can use it. But guys, you have to make sure that uh, whatever the columns you are using in which the data type is number data type. You cannot use over here first name. Let me show you over here. It will give definitely error. So as you can see over here, it got the error. So what is the conclusion? Conclusion is whenever you are trying to perform the arithmetic operation using the column only, then you have to make sure that whatever the columns you are using that should have the number data type just like the salary department id and other column if we have okay now instead of this you can use uh, the arithmetic operation in the where clause as well so let me show you how we can use it so this is the uh, query i have written in order to save the time so you can see over here i have used the arithmetic operation in the where clause as well. So let me close this one first. So you can see over here arith arithmetic operation I have performed. So let me show you the uh, content of this directly. So this is the content and this is how it performed. So how exactly it retrieve this records? You can question that. So guys simply you need to think uh, you need to replace whatever the 
content of the employee table and in that whatever the salary is there you have to replace this salary column with the whatever the actual value is there and after that you have to subtract the 200 let's say for example <coughs> let me uh, uh, let me fire over here let me do it so let's say for example where is 8200 82 82 okay so let's say for example this is the value and the cursor is over here so what it will do it will uh, pick up this data this data over here and it will place over here so 8200 minus 200 which is nothing but 800 uh, 8000 so the condition is true so this uh, row will be get picked up now in the same way if i will place over here 24000 if the cursor is over here then what i need to do i need to place over here 24000 minus 200 which is, is equal to 8000 no so that's why it won't be picked up so this is also you can use and this is the one of the form of the arithmetic operation in the where class so you can increase the complexity as per the your requirement so guys i hope you have understood what exactly the arithmetic operation and how can we use it so that's all from my side from the arithmetic point of view now it's time for the practice so let's have a look on the assignment and guys if you like the video then hit the like button share it and subscribe it thank you so much for watching for the video bye bye take care